as a president of this nation, I am morally and constitutionally bound to preserve this precious form of governance. I vow to do my utmost best to protect your rights, freedom, and liberty as citizens of Nigeria. Even more than that, I pledge to do whatever is necessary to cement democracy as our way of life. Although the challenges are steep and multiple, I am grateful to lead Nigeria at this moment in our history and point in our democratic journey. I come before you also to declare that our most important work remains before us. The real test has never been whether we will rise to the challenge, the sling of misfortune and grievous pains of dictatorship. The real test is whether we shall lower our guns and fail to defend democracy as the shadow of despotism and its evident physical danger hid. I say to you here and now that as we celebrate the enshrinement of our political democracy, let us commit ourselves to the fulfillment of equally important counterpart, the realization of our economic democracy. I understand the economic difficulties we face as a nation right now. Our economy has been in desperate need of reform for decades. It has been unbalanced because it was built on the flawed foundations and over-reliance on revenue from exploitation of oil. The reforms we have initiated are intended to create a stronger, better foundation for future growth. There is no doubt that the reform has occasioned hardship. I feel your pain. Yet, the unnecessary repairs required to fix the economy over the long run so that everyone has access to economic opportunity, fair pay, and compensation for its endeavor and labor. As we continue to reform the economy, I shall always listen to the people and will never turn my back on you.